Yo, what's going on guys? How are y'all? Uh, the tires just came in the mail for the 240, so we're gonna get those installed today. So I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all those. And then we're also gonna take the head gasket at three o'clock to my buddy Tracy, the one that's building my motor, to uh, get this motor done so I can get this car done and also get these tires mounted. So we're gonna try to do that. I have work at seven today, but um, let me show you the parts really quickly. Alrighty guys, so here we go. Here's the head gasket that I went with. My buddy had to get some more measurements and stuff before he could tell me what the head gasket size was. And well, he got it uh, before he went out of town for uh, GGP. So anyways, this is the head gasket that I went with. It says S14, but the receipt and the advertisement said S13. So, you better hope this works. Not my buddy Tracy, but the person who sold this to me. Because if not, it's false advertisement. Because I don't know if that additional oil hole is going to have any issue with it. But I don't think it should. <clears throat> as long as the head seals, we should be alright. So, I'm going to go ahead and close this up. Alrighty, guys. So, here are the tires. I went with a 215 45 17 on a 17 by 9 uh, so we're going to have a little bit of stretch, maybe just enough. Who knows? We'll see once it's on the tire or on the wheel. So I'm super excited. These are just some cheapies because I'm going to burn these. These are just going to be my drift spares. Or not drift spares, even my like good drift wheels. But I'm going to burn these and then I'm just going to swap these over to the rear when I put my other ones on, my other wheels. But anyways, I'm super excited and I can't wait to get these on because I've had these wheels for so long. And I finally got the tires to be able to put the wheels on. I'm sorry about this. I'm sorry. Sorry about my son's toys. I've been watching the stock market and like stock trading and stuff. I'm trying to get into stock trading. So anyways, um, yeah, guys. So, I mean, once we get these on the wheels, I mean, it's going to look phenomenal. I mean, I seen a dude on a 240SX Owners Club that had this tire size, and that's why I went on a square setup, and it looked amazing. So hopefully I can go lower on my coils, and once the motor's back in it, it'll lower the front, also the rear. So let's get this to the uh, tire shop. Alrighty, guys. So I'm just loading these tires in the truck, like so. Finally. Oh, wait. Actually, we should play. No, get over here. Get over here. Car to take the truck over there so it's easier for me. I left my front door open so hopefully no one steals anything. <laughs> What's going on guys? So right now we are heading or we're actually about to pull up to my shop. So um I'm about maybe half a mile down the street. Um anyways, so we're gonna pick up the wheels and then we're gonna head to Allison Tire, it's who I used to go for my truck uh, when I used to get my wheels changed or my tires changed out. Uh, they always did a good job and they were pretty fast. So hopefully they can do it without scratching the wheels. I'm going to ask them because, I mean, I don't want to get my brand new wheels scratched. So anyways, when I get there, I don't know if I'm going to film or not. I mean, I'm not that comfortable yet to be able to film around just like other people's like businesses. I mean, it's a small business, so I don't mean, I mean, you never know what goes on. But anyways, let's uh, get this taken care of. So we're about to pull up. All right, guys. So we just left the shop. or actually closed the shop doors. We got the wheels right here. As you can see, I just did a quick like back-to-back uh, -back of like the tire and the wheel back-to-back. Uh, uh, -back. And it's freaking it's going to have a good amount of stretch. I mean, I wasn't really more looking for stretch. But I mean, I'm not going to complain because it's kind of going to look good. But... Yeah, guys, so let's go to the tire shop. All right, guys, so we're pulling up to the tire shop right now. Sorry, I don't mean to have such a close angle, but I mean, oh, well, hopefully they have a spot available. I mean, they kind of look a little packed, but oh, well, and someone just pulled up, so that doesn't help. So hopefully we can get in this. I'm gonna go ahead and turn right here. What's up guys? So we just got the wheels back from the tire shop and they came out phenomenal. They included the valve stems in here. So we're gonna go ahead and, oh my God. Anyways, we're gonna go ahead and put all these wheels on once we get them to the shop. And yeah guys. What's 
going on guys? So right now we are on the way to Odessa to drop the head gasket off at Nissan to my buddy Tracy. Uh, I hope y'all like the way the wheels look. But uh, sorry I couldn't film the, like, the ending too much because uh, my buddy Michael was kind of needed help on some things. So I tried to film as much as I could. Sorry about the wind noise. My truck, one of the sails is like kind of ripped so it try, uh, air like escapes through somehow. But anyways, so we're about seven minutes away from Nissan in Odessa and once I get there I might film or might not I don't know how I feel about filming around other people but it'll be alright I feel comfortable around people I know know but not around like people that I barely met or like you know don't hang around with all the time but anyways so let's go oh yeah we got Louie so say hi Louie he's just chilling enjoying I love this dude, he's my buddy, my best friend. Love you, son. All right, guys, so we just entered Odessa, and look at that sky, the Texas sky, man. It looks so nice. But yeah, guys, there's Odessa, Texas, if y'all never been there. I mean, I personally don't come over here all the time because, I mean, I don't like it. I mean, I have family that lives over here, but I mean, I don't know. I like Odessa, though, in a way. I don't like it, but I do like it. But anyways, Nissan is like the next uh, main street to the right. So we're just going to turn right, and then we'll turn to left, and we'll be there. So, hi, Louie. Sorry about my tent on my truck. My dog did that. So, see you. All right, guys. So, let's go ahead and take this to Tracy. He's not here, so he said just leave it in the stall. So, Alrighty guys, so that's it for the video. As you can see, I just dropped it off real quickly, or real quick. I was gonna stay and like look at it and stuff, but there was a guy right there, so I didn't. But either way, the motor looked good from what I could tell. I mean, I already know it's gonna be good, so I mean, I trust my guy. He's cool as hell. Doesn't doesn't give me a problem about anything. I mean, anything I need help on, he got me. So shout out to you, Tracy. Thank you for building my motor. Also, thank you to Allison Tire for doing my mounting my wheels. And yeah, guys, so I'll see y'all around on the next video. Catch y'all later.